Hello, darlings. How you guys doing? A gorilla for you? Yeah, I think so. Welcome to my channel. My name is Carol, and today we're gonna watch some Ariana Grande shady moments because, yes, I feel like watching some Ariana Grande's videos. So, let's get it started. Right. It'll break your heart right back. A lot of people are talking about it. Yeah. And then you said, and I'm Well, yeah, quote. because people took my quote and made a headline out of it. I know what y'all do. Of course. Well, I know what y'all do. No, 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 no. <laughs> They twisted it, though. They twisted it, though. All right, so. That is not what I said. Break it down. I said, break your heart right back is about a boy who cheats on a girl with a boy. I never said my ex cheated on me with a boy. That's not what I ever said. But you said 99%. You're sure that it's happened In to the you past, before. I never said my ex. She's okay. getting angry. <laughs> but you know, a ex has happened. It's no, happened. It, I mean, it wasn't even an ex, really. We were just sort of dating for like a minute. It wasn't, mm. it wasn't a big deal. Oh, yeah, I'm actually where I am because I hate when people kind of, like she said, they twisted everything, like the story. And I hate when people do that because they say, what, Ariana Grande versus Selena Gomez, what? Oh yeah, I remember this video. Oh my god, that was so funny. I oh, know. Is she gonna shake Selena? Don't do that, please, Ariana. At least you know I'm on track, right? She did. She did. Aww, Selena. Aww. I love you anyway. Well, I love her anyway. But when it ended, Ariana claimed it was because Victoria wanted to go on tour, despite the fact that the rest of the cast would have been happy to keep the show going. And she said all this on Twitter. Now, Victoria did not let that fly. So then she took to Twitter to say this. Some people would throw someone that they consider a friend under the bus just to make themselves look good. Hashtag stop being a phony. Hashtag if they only knew. Damn. <laughs> Ouch. She knew she messed up. Um, do you know what you're wearing for the performance yet? Oh, she's so beautiful here. I can't I can't tell you everything. Well, you can give like a vibe, no? No. No. All right. Well, that's fine. If you could Aww, use makeup or your photo. phone one last time, which one would you pick? Is this one what you think time. girls have trouble choosing? <laughs> yeah, I absolutely. Is this, you, yes. is this men so assuming that that's what girls would have to choose yes. between? Now, this is not a question. Uh, can you really go anywhere without your cell phone? Yes. How long Ooh. can you go without looking at Twitter? Many hours. I like to be present and talking. Good like quality. That. Eye contact. Ladies learn. learn. Yeah. Listen yeah. and yeah. learn, yeah. ladies. Boys learn. Oh, excuse me. That's not a diva shade thing. Like, I do that every single time because I have a lot of paparazzi taking pictures of me everywhere. I'm just kidding. <clears throat> Come on, that's not that's not you that bad. Than like, talking about you. I guess so. you know, because I mean? you don't want to be beige. You don't want to be like uh, Leona Lewis or. Uh... Who's an, what no do you mean? Cares about anymore. Who's someone no one cares about? I'm gonna name someone. You're, I'm you're a you. jerk. He <laughs> is actually. This is what I gotta deal with on a regular basis. I hate like this man every day. Oh, well, she's <laughs> right. She's right. I hate that man as well. You don't talk crap no, about no, Leonardo I mean, Lewis. You know, I mean, I guess yes. I would much rather them talk about my music though. Diva rumors have plagued Ari for quite some time, and E News anchor Juliana Rancic was happy to just perpetuate those reports when she talked about a memorable encounter with the singer. I remember, I think it was at the AMAs, she came up on the platform and, you know, normally I stand on this side to the camera. You know, I had to fight 13 years to get this side to the camera. It's my good side, but I fought 13 years for this, okay? Little Ariana comes over, I felt like, bang, elbow in my side. I'm like, what's going on? And they pushed me to the other side. Come on, So I pushed? had to be on my ugly side. They didn't oh, like push, side, yeah. but I felt like a little bit of a, you know, it was like, you either get on the other side or we don't do an interview. That was a little demon. I had to say that. Well, she's just getting in her car, so I don't, I don't find it demon shitty. 
But there are some fans who want a picture. Just one picture, please. That's what I want. That's all what I want. Oh, um, bye. Oh, Unicorn's so great, obviously, of course. Girls. Um, yeah, boys. Many boys <laughs> use the unicorn. Well, boys. You need a little one. brushing up on equality over here. <laughs> I don't want to hang right. out of power on a second. Oh, hey, okay. We're gonna... If you could fix one problem in the world, what would it be? Yeah, um, double standards, misogyny, racism, mm. sexism, mm. you know, all that shit. Yeah, yeah work to do. Oh, okay, yeah. we got we work to do. We'll start with you, though. Good. Yeah. So yes. Let's see who these beautiful and talented. Oh, no. How could you do that? He's so and cute. I would never do that. Like, and if you want to kiss me, I'm ready. Ariana Grande. She's so tiny. Oh, are you serious? Come on. Oh, I was. Look at him. Why would you do that? Oh, that's okay, yeah. The princess has been accused of demanding to be carried when she doesn't feel like walking. Ariana has shared photos of her personal Instagram being carried by her staff. In December 2013, she Instagrammed a pic of herself being carried off stage and captioned it, post-show ritual when my feet... You guys are the worst. Then in March, she posted a photo wrapped up tightly in a blanket as one crew member carries her and another holds an umbrella over her head. According to reports from Life & Style, an insider says that she says that she doesn't want her precious feet to hit the floor and reportedly saw Grande demand to be carried by her staff while filming a music video and during rehearsals for the Victoria's Secret fashion show. Is that true? Show. Really? I don't... Oh, come on. This is you and Justin. Yeah. Is this a friendly shot? Yeah. Yeah. This is like beyond friendly looking. Ryan, come on, be good. Ariana, I talk. didn't do it. This says... He's so into you. No. And the rumor is. I don't think so. Are you what's ready for it? Oh, Ellen, God. I don't know if we are. What are we what are the, what's Okay, the because we need to know the truth, right? All right. <sighs> the rumors are that Nathan really wants to date you, so he's calling and texting and won't leave you alone. Hello? Justin Bieber also Neighbors? wants to date you, and he is sending this you is the flowers. Most humorous thing I've ever heard of. <laughs> well, I kind of, I kind of get her. I mean, I think it's really, it must be really tiring to uh, hear people talking crap about you and making up lies and rumors, you know. So I kind of get her. Moschino! And she was making him delete pictures as they went and then she kind of just bailed on the shoot. And no, she wanted to change her shirt but then she didn't come back and and I did hear this is really interesting. There was a, this whole list of demands that she gave media that day for her Australian press day. Uh -huh. It said no questions about Mariah Carey, no questions about relationships, her boyfriend, no questions about Jamie McCurdy, no questions about Sam and Cat. It could go on, but I thought the Mariah Carey thing was the most interesting. I didn't get anything about that. That look, girl. TMZ. Food. I should eat. It's kind of late and in 14, 45 minutes I got a date. No, I don't have a date. I just have to walk it up with a friend of mine. <laughs> so I really should go and... Really? Uh-uh, that was wrong. That was really wrong. That was really wrong. Ariana, that was wrong. Like a drive-thru restaurant, okay? And we're gonna give you options. Jesus, help me. You ready? Yeah. All right, cool deal. What would you like scandal number one, which is a hacked cell phone, or combo scandal uh, scandal number two, which is a surprise? What kind of question is this? Absolutely, scandal number one. Uh, for a dollar more, we can start a tweet war if you like. You have a choice of kicking it off with Kanye West. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Of course. So <laughs> what would you like us to write for you? That's so funny, man. You write it for me. You go ahead. I'm not getting involved. Hashtag She's smart. Trump. This is a game. This can get serious real fast. This is the dumbest game ever. <laughs> She's right. She's right. Ariana, I'm with you. Thank you so much for playing along, girl. Thank you for uh, that really uh, great game. And that took a little jab at Ariana and her web series, What's Next for Sarah, with a character named Gloriana, who was obsessed with herself and what some are saying is a very heightened version of Ariana Grande. Got to Perez Ooh. Hilton tweeting about the show, telling Jeanette, it was super funny. Can I be in an upcoming episode? I can be Gloriana's obnoxious gay brother. 
Ha! Oh my god, yes! Or Gloriana's boyfriend who gets cheated on eight times. Perez kept it going by adding OMFG to- I'm shocked. I'm not even joking, let's make this happen. P.S. I heard that Gloriana gets around. <laughs> That's a good response though. I would have done the same thing though. Like, you guys don't mess with, you know, personal life. <laughs> what? What do you want? And they were like, talk to me about boys. And I was like, and I was like, no. And they were like, why? And I was like, because I'm not Big Sean's ex. I'm not Niall's possible new girl. I'm Ariana Grande, and if that's not interesting enough, don't talk to me. Believe Ooh. it or not, women can be friends with people with dicks and not hop on them. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, so um, honestly, I, I'm not like a huge Ariana Grande fan. I mean, I love most of her songs, but I don't follow her a lot. So I don't, I don't know a lot about her. Uh, but uh, there were some shady moments and some diva moments, but I think most of the video uh, is about her uh, responding to a lot of you know, interviewers uh, being a little bit, um, you know, not uh, respectful. I mean, there are some things you can joke about, there are some things you can't. You're not allowed at all to joke about. So, uh, I'm kind of with her in most of, of the video. Then there is this um, part where she says, I hate Americans because of uh, um, some food. I didn't see what that was. That was kind of diva shitty, but it was more diva than shitty, but yeah. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Let me know down below in the comments if you want more and if you have any thoughts about this video. And yeah, take care and I'll see you very soon. Bye!